This is a CBS News special report. I'm Anthony Mason in New York. The Labor Department has just released its weekly unemployment numbers. The data show massive job losses for a 10th straight week since the pandemic began hitting the economy. CBS News business analyst Jill Schlesinger joins us now. Jill, what are the numbers this week? An additional 2.1 Americans filed for unemployment benefits last week. And that puts us up at about 40 million Americans over the course of 10 weeks. Now, I should also note that the Labor Department is starting to also report on those folks who are claiming the pandemic unemployment assistance for contractors and gig workers. And that number is about 8 million. So that's not even included in the 40 million. Although these numbers are trending lower, these are still disastrous numbers. 10 times more than where we were before the pandemic hit, Anthony. Yeah, a staggering number still, Jill, even as they're declining slightly. Uh, what industries, if any, Jill, are hiring at this point? Well, we've talked a lot about some of the warehouses that are adding people and the places like Amazon and Target and Walmart. But there is some evidence that we're seeing a demand for security guards, senior care workers, people who are online for uh, bankers and mortgage brokers, landscapers, and essential businesses like defense contractors. The problem is that although this is a glimmer of hope, these folks are adding about, say, three jobs for every 10 layoffs that are actually going on. So we are still running a huge deficit when it comes to getting workers off the sidelines. All right, Jill Schlesinger, thanks you once again. 2.1 million Americans filing for unemployment last week.